in the absurd unfolding and forgetting of that savage slaughter. Sometimes one wishes words were bullets. The projectile will find a target long immune to punishment. Headline, July 19, 2015. The massacre planner crossed the flat line. Such ease, touching retribution. Your progeny shall carry the infamy of how your guns and gold can bend the law in a country where justice must not be laid to rest with you. Andal Ampatuan Sr. is dead. Headline, August 24, 2018. From mass graves to air-conditioned jail to cathedral aisle. No matter what you wear, you are the main sponsor of a massacre. You are the pampered prisoner. You reek of blood of innocent souls. You march down to the altar with fellow felons who mock justice and smirk and stride with impunity. What a moving scene to see you all marching and moving on to the fires of the people's fury. When banners are buried in inside pages, November 17, 2019. It's been 10 long years. We issue press releases of remembrance and protest. We count time that points us because the tragedy is banner no more. No lead or slant is strong enough to shake the halls of power. Buried in inside pages of the collective memory are names unprepared for a mass grave. Justice is a well-worn robe whose gavel can twist the law of tyranny. We are still holding a vigil in this barren landscape, raw calling a never-ending list of bloodbath. Our words are shut down, pulverized by sanctions and pushed to silence. The land is one brutalized field. But our pens and keyboards are mightier than a backhoe. We will not retreat. 